Now to the heat index. First up, uh, Will Smith reportedly in talks to tackle the NFL's concussion problem. A hot button issue, as you know, right now. Even President Obama is raising the topic. He did at a youth event last week. Variety reporting that the uh, that Smith will play the forensic neuropathologist mm. who first discovered the brain disease, CTE, in a professional football player, brought awareness to the public. CTE has been found in athletes when with a history of repeated brain trauma. The Untitled Project is one of a number of Hollywood projects revolving around the growing concerns over concussions in the NFL. And if the NFL thinks this is going away, it is not. No, yeah, no. not lawsuit at all. after lawsuit. Mm -hmm. yep. yeah. now I, mean, I think it's after great moving. that, that yeah. we're the getting discussion. this message out. It's a, an, such it an important discussion. It is really having an impact. Yep. It's not going away. One yep. of the other things we saw, the, the headline of the Times this mm -hmm. morning, actually one of the most popular stories on the Times website we've all been reading this morning. You yeah. can't seem to sort of concentrate during the day, you know, when you're what? looking at Twitter. <laughs> exactly. What? Exactly. Where, exactly. where Lara, am I? Exhibit A, Lara Spencer. <laughs> anyway, this, this op-ed actually talks about following in the footsteps of children because you know they get interested in something and they concentrate on it and then they bring it to the group of their friends and so what what basically the psychologist Aww. is arguing it's a David Brooks column but they argue that we all should when we get distracted allow ourselves to go there enjoy it and bring it back to the group I love that idea. that's I when do kids too. aren't doing this yeah, yeah exactly. Right. Because this is what I see. Well, they all can the focus time. on that. Yeah. We have to say no screens because, but they, they do live in the moment. Children live in the moment. And mm -hmm. I always marvel at that. And I agree. We can learn We're something from them. Yeah, yeah, it's a great We read. take their devices away. Exactly. And <laughs> yours right. too, Amy. I'm just speaking from yeah, personal experience. All right. Next up, researchers capturing what they believe is the first photographic evidence that babies in the womb can feel their mother's stress. Great. Another thing to worry about when you're pregnant. <laughs> Using 4D sonogram scanners, they created these images that found when a mother felt anxious or stressed, the baby tried to soothe itself by touching its head. Let's bring in ABC News senior medical contributor, Dr. Jen it Ashen. Just happens to you, just, I, you just heard what I said. Yeah, I mean, heard it yes. running in. Yeah. That's my reaction. You know, when you're pregnant, you're worried about doing everything right. And now it's like, great, if I'm stressed, the baby's stressed. I think I've heard that before, uh, yeah, but is this I, I sort of always believe that. Yeah. Well, listen, this is opening a Pandora's box. First of all, very small study. They, que they did questionnaires for women in the second half of their pregnancy and then did 4D and 3D sonograms and tracked fetal movement. Now, they made some observations, which is always a good thing in medicine and science. They made some associations between women who said they were stressed and fetal movements. But do we know that one causes the other at this point? No. Okay, so the babies were either maybe sucking their thumbs. What does that mean? When touching their head. Them? Well, this is the interesting thing, you guys. I have done thousands and thousands of fetal sonograms. We actually look for flexion in the fetal arm and hand as a sign of fetal well-being. That's not a negative. We don't want a limp fetus because that can tell us that it's not getting enough oxygen. Right. So right. We, we need a lot more research before we can say that this in a fetus is a bad thing. Yeah. I mean, for an adult, if I go like this, that maybe mm -hmm. I'm stressed. But for a fetus, you can't. Say that. I, the takeaway, yeah. if any, though, is just I, I don't you think it's great advice, though, to just shh, namaste when you're pregnant. Right, just but try to what remain as pregnant calm as woman possible. is not a little stressed oh, at some oh, point in their pregnancy? I, I, so we all are for sure. But I say take the pressure off the pregnant woman, not give her more yes. things to worry amen. about. Amen. We could keep saying yeah. amen. All right. Today. Yeah, yes. amen. Thank exactly. you. Is your daughter Jen. over there? Yes, Hi. she is over there. Hey. Oh. See, I was stressed in my pregnancy. Look how normal she is. She's just fine. And a heck of a hockey player, too. Thank you. Wow. She's over there. Like this, though. Yeah. She's yeah. got her hand <laughs> over her head. Uh -oh. That's right. real side.